you described the, uh, the strike as a uh, possible mistake by Israel. According to uh, Haaretz, the Israeli newspaper, it wasn't one strike, but three. The first one, then an interval during which aid workers got out of their vehicles, removed the wounded, tried to move to another vehicle which was struck, and then a third strike what, as they tried to move and escape in a third vehicle, at which point all of them uh, were dead. How would the second and third strikes of these marked vehicles be a mistake? And why would the U.S. not more forcefully set conditions on the use of U.S.-made weaponry when it is being used to target aid workers? If the first one was a mistake, the second two were targeted with the intent of killing everyone in that convoy. So how do you respond to that? Uh, first of all, there's an investigation going on. So why don't we let it get done? And why don't we see what they find in terms of the decision-making process that led to this terrible outcome? The Prime Minister and the IDF have noted that it was their error. If you don't like the word mistake, their error. Uh, they're investigating it. Let them do that work and let them see what they come up with. Uh, and then we'll go from there. Two years ago, uh, the IDF killed uh, an Al Jazeera journalist. They said that that was a, a mistake. Uh, that she was wearing a Mark Press vest, she was shot anyway. They investigated it and they uh, released the findings of their investigation, which found that they were at fault. Go they on. Uh, but my, my question, sir, is in that case, uh, these, the Israelis did not initiate any criminal uh, proceeding. In this case, if it's found that the marked convoy was deliberately targeted, if not with the first shot, but the second two shots, would the U.S. support uh, <coughs> criminal penalties? As I said, we would expect that uh, should there be a need for accountability, that account accountability be properly put in place for whoever may be responsible for this. But again, that's gonna, a lot of that's going to depend on the investigation.